must come to the dark side. Yeah, I just left the dark side about an hour ago. Uh, it is four. Oh, it's international pot smoking time. It's 4:20. Actually, I think that's 4:20 p.m. It's 4:20 a.m. Look at me all bedheaded and baggy-eyed. So this is an unusual circumstance for me. I'm a historically phenomenal sleeper. And this night, I can't even say last night. It's not even far enough into it to go last night. So this is still it. Uh, couldn't sleep for shit. <laughs> Went to bed. Did all the right things yesterday, too. Lots of good exercise yesterday, tennis lesson. And I uh, ate great, perfect nutrition yesterday. Even more my goddamn blue blockers for a couple hours before I went to bed, you know. Took my nighttime supplements and uh, slept maybe from 10 till 1. And then rolled around from 1 till 3.30 and said, ah, fuck it. Let's get up and, and do something. So what happened was I, I woke up, I was pretty pissed. So I'm losing some weight right now. And I know how really important deep sleep is to weight loss so i you know i get excited because when i do when i do things like perfectly when i have a perfectly spent day as far as health goes i'm very excited to weigh in the next morning to see what i lost and uh i only lost a tiny little bit but i did everything perfect so i was expecting to you know hit a, a little a, a milestone and it didn't happen so i didn't get what i wanted so i was, I was a little frustrated in bed I think even cursed at one point, and uh, and then and then after I stepped off the scale, I yelled "fuck" in my bathroom. <laughs> so that's why I was talking about the dark side. Uh, so uh, I was legit pissed. So I remembered one of my favorite mantras, which is every set of circumstances. Well, there's two mantras actually. The, the first one is. This is the best goddamn thing that could have happened, right? So that I actually said that to myself. You know what? I shifted really fast from to you know what? This is the best goddamn thing that could happen. And then I followed that up with another mantra, and that's why I love these mantras. They're so freaking powerful. They're tools that help me shift so rapidly from dark to light. So the next one is, you know, every set of circumstances can be leveraged from or leveraged. Uh, if viewed masterfully, can be leveraged for gain. Every set of circumstances can be created from, if viewed masterfully. So, so the next thing I did, I did some dental hygiene, and actually I did a little. I trimmed up my goatee. It was getting nasty. It was getting like real ZZ topish. So, uh, but then I came upstairs and uh, up here, and uh, my I have a meditation space right outside, whatever, right outside the office doors here, and I did a nice long half hour meditation. And um, and I could feel during it, and it's transcendental meditation or colloquially, it's easy for me to say, the gap, where you're practicing stopping giving a damn about your thoughts and simply letting them come and letting them go without giving a damn about them, not getting involved with them, just letting them arise and let them flow away. And 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 with that. Uh, you know what else floated away is my frustration and now I'm in a perfect mood and here I am creating right and I'm going to create some more stuff I'm going to do this video for you uh, as a reminder that uh, so I, you know I have I don't have my phone with me but um, I have these messages sent automatically to my phone the text messages that remind me of things I want to um, remember and one of them is this is the best damn thing that could have happened so that reminder is working and uh, I encourage you to adopt it, right? So, when, so a an option for when you catch yourself below the O line, in other words, feeling unpleasant, emotionally uncool, catch it as fast as you can, replace it with a mantra or two. This is the best damn thing could have happened, and you don't even need to know why. That's just a shift. All it does is it shifts you out of the whiner, victimy state. It's an instantaneous upgrade to your emotional state. You're literally changing your mind. And then you can follow up with, okay, what can I create from this? And and then go create. So I'm going to have an amazingly productive morning. So, all right, create miracles, folks. Talk to you soon.